If you want to become mustaghni, if you want to be free from worldly want, connect with the connect with the one who created this world. How to make money? Connect with Allah. Where is this coming from? How to make money? Connect with Allah. Because unless you connect with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the makhluk of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will not be subject to you. And that's the reason why tarbiyah is so important and why tasqiyatul nafs is so important because only then can the nur of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala come into the heart. And only then can the slave ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because he connects with Allah. Hassan al-Basri rahmatullah is standing up for tahajjud. And before he starts his salah, he says, Oh Allah, the, even the stars have gone to sleep. There are not even any stars in the sky. He says, Oh Allah, there are only two who are awake. You on your arsh and me here. Eh? So don't say no, but you see at that time in Australia it was daybreak, so people were... Eh? I am talking about the connection of the Abd to the Rabb. Connection of the Abd to the Rabb. And what is the result of this connection? Hassan al-Basri was praying tahajjud and he heard some movement in his house as if somebody has entered his house. And uh, he continued to salah. But when he finished the salah, there was a man standing there. And the man told him, what kind of a man are you? Huh? So Hassan al-Basri said, what happened? He said, I am a thief. And I came to your house to steal something. But he said, you have nothing. <laughs> he said, that thief also was a, was a, <laughs> must have been a classic character. I mean, he, he waited to tell him all this. So he, <laughs> said, so he said, you have nothing. He said, what kind of a man are you? You have nothing. So Hassan al-Basri said, no, no, I have got plenty. I will give you. I will give you. So the man said, what have you got? He said, no, you go make wudu and come. You make wudu and come, I'll give you. Eh? So the thief said, all right, he got nothing, maybe this guy is going to give him something. He went, made, he met wudu and came. So Hassan was, he said, now you stand here. And he said, Allahu Akbar. And he prayed to Rakat of Tahajjud. And this thief prayed next to him. The thief was also a Muslim. Most thieves are anyway, so it's nothing new. <laughs> It's true. <laughs> so he stood next to Hassan al-Basri rahmatullah and he, he prayed tahajjud. And when he prayed, when he finished praying, Hassan al-Basri asked him, did you get something? And the man was weeping. The man was weeping. And he said, I make tawbah. He said, I make tawbah. He said, may Allah protect me. I, my life has been wasted. I said, from today, no thieving. No, no stealing. He said, I make tawbah. So Hassan al-Basri said, I can only give what I have. Allah wa'alaam ke paas jaoge, Allah milega. Isi liye sohbat ki ahmiyat hai. That's the importance of sohbat. You go to the people of dunya, you get dunya. You go to people of Allah, you get Allah.